we originally focused on e-commerce, getting the goods that you buy online to you quicker and more efficiently um, by adapting uh, philosophies from successful natural systems. So we've had a lot of inbound from anybody out there in the industry that wants to source things and move them around their facility more efficiently than any other technology can deliver. So we see applications for that in supply chain. But in manufacturing, we see great applications for this. We have worked with some of our customer partners to create kitting solutions for um, circuit board pick and place equipment. Certainly kitting and storage for automotive parts and aerospace parts. Now our robots work in our matrix and granted they're very, very efficient in there. Uh, but they could be directed anywhere in a facility in three dimensions. So we can deliver these kits of parts to any position in a facility um, just in time. So this is actually uh, an automotive facility, uh, part storage. Um, everything in the bottom red square actually ends up fitting in that blue rectangle at the top. So from a manufacturing point of view, if you're a space constraint and you have existing real estate assets that you want to repurpose, um, and still start, now start adapting um, conveyance as well as storage and retrieval, sequencing, sortation, and buffering uh, into your workflows, um, we'd like to talk to you. So we're developing the technology to start applying industry 4.0 practices, um, embedding IoT sensors in all of our bins, and coordinate the movement of goods in a facility, but in a non-linear fashion. Um, assembly lines, or exactly that, the lines, conveyor belts, or a unidirectional fixed piece of infrastructure. If you apply a three-dimensional grid to manufacturing, it gives you more redundancy, way more flexibility, uh, and a more efficient use of space to allow your facility to free up um, for growth, uh, as well as other product lines. So this is something we'd like to explore beyond some of the conversations we're having right now in automotive and aerospace. So if you have an application uh, that you think would benefit from this technology, I invite you to contact us. Thank you very much.